Hello everyone, welcome back. Today we are starting a brand new series on the channel. Super, super excited. Um, so let's jump into it. We are gonna do a brand new save and uh, watch this little video. 52% of our patients believe they leave healthier than when they arrived. Our precise that is good. equipment is operated by compassionate healthcare practitioners, many of whom have even been to medical school or watched ER. If you suffer <laughs> from turtle head, let us ease your worries and noggin gently out of your body. Just mm. infection is no laughing matter. Put your trust and oversized shoes in our capable hands. We're building a brighter, safer future, and hardly anything will stand in our way. You deserve the best. So join us at Two Point Hospital. We're open for new staff, new patients, and a new you. Can I go play golf yet? I'm teeing off at three. Okay, I am so excited to play this. I um, have played this previously. I'm about um, 10 hours in on a different save. Um, but yeah, so welcome to Two Point County. I'm Albert Crank. I'll be your trusty advisor on this journey. Yay! This is Hogsport, your first hospital. Uh, click on it to get started. Okay, I will do some clicking. Hogsport. Uh, begin your career as a hospital administration. Learn the basics of the job by first establishing your hospital. Okay, we'll uh, get started. So yeah, I'm about 10 hours in on my other save, so I know a little bit what I'm doing. Um, I did watch some YouTube videos. Um, so yeah. Are you ready to start your first building? Building your first hospital and curing some patients. Yes, I am. First things first, you'll probably want to have a look around. Uh, just basic keys. Okay, I'll uh, just fly through this real quick. I, I know all the keys and stuff. Okay, first things first, Let's we need a reception. Patients her, Patients will head there when they arrive at the hospital. Let's build a reception desk near the entrance. Items. Reception. Um, so I know a lot of people like do it like, oh shoot, how do you turn items again? Oh, uh, you can use Z and X to rotate, uh, place it, and cancel. Awesome. Okay, I know a lot of people like do it here, but I think I want to be a little different and maybe put the reception like over here, and then we can do a small waiting room. Cool. Ah, uh, great. We need an assistant to run the exception. Let's hire one now. Click on the hire um, and select on assistance to view applications click on the hire cool assistance um okay and i know we want to look for stats so you're really good at customer service so let's get you oh, just put you right there Us. what did she say okay <laughs> Um, great. Before we can officially open, we need a GP's office. Um, patients will visit a doctor while working. A uh, doctor working as a general practitioner at each stage of diagnosis. The GP assesses the patients and decides if they are ready for treatment or if they refer require further diagnosis. Awesome. Okay, we're going to build a room now. Um, build a GP's office. Um kind of thinking let's put that like right there yeah that'll be that'll be nice put the door right there this is so backwards which side okay I guess the computer faces the way that um, where the doctor would be oh um, we can't put them there so let's just Add a couple filing cabinets, get prestige up a little bit. Um, let's add a plant. Um, we don't have 
anything really, but I know we do unlock more as we play. So yeah, let's get a bin there. Um, sure, why not? Got a picture. Awesome. That's good enough for me for now. Excellent. Now we do need a doctor to run the GP's office. Hire one now. Okay. Doctors. Um, so this one has percent in diagnostics. This one has diagnostics, treatment, and general practice. Let's get you because you're good at general practice. Good, now our doors are open for business. Pa patients are finally starting to arrive. After they register at reception, they'll be sent to GPs for diagnostics. Is it diagnostics or diagnosis? Zooming and rotate. To zoom in and out, use the mouse wheel to rotate, hold the middle mouse and move, and then to pitch um, and move the mouse up and down. Cool. Oh, I gotta do it all? Cool. Look around, days. Let's keep an eye on our first patients. Oh, I already um, did all that. Oh, I don't like how you can't do multiple at a time. Like, it's either rotate or pitch. That's kind of annoying. Oh well. Um, I think, um, actually, I was gonna maybe turn down the rate or the volume, but I think now maybe I don't need to so much. Um, let's get a couple of benches around. Maybe there, make a little, like, waiting area. Uh, let's go like right there. Oh. We've diagnosed our first patient. The GP has sent you a message. I look at the message in the bottom left. Uh, bottom right, sorry. Looks like we need to build a pharmacy to treat the patient. Okay. Um, okay, we'll uh, go build that room. Let's get the patient to wait. Um, and build a pharmacy. Let's put the pharmacy maybe over here? Over here, question mark? Is that a good spot, question mark? Um, we'll go like there. Sure. Um, we don't really want to block the window. We'll just go like that. Um, get a couple of filing cabinets in. Oh, come on. I don't like how it's snapping. Um, we will get a fire extinguisher. Another bin. Maybe another little plant. Um, and sure, why not? It's very empty right now. Um, but it will be okay. Uh, you got pharmacy skills, so that just makes sense. Um, let's see if our new staff are up to the test. Let's see, are we curing him? Wait, how did he jump the line when she came in first? Because she was our first patient. What is your name? Paul Fluster. Um, maybe we should get some benches around here. Oh, I don't like the um, edge of camera zoom or scroll or whatever that is. Well done, we've cured our first patient. We've earned some extra money and the hospital reputation has improved, which will attract more patients. When a doctor or a nurse treats a patient, their ability will influence the chance of success. Some illnesses are tougher than others. Continuing diagnosis, continue diagnosing and treating patients to uh, keep the money coming in so we can expand the hospital. Sure thing. That is a great announcement. I'm sure everyone at the hospital would want to hear that. Um, let's finish in this little area here. Oh, maybe not. Now we've got some expensive machinery. We should think about looking after it. Me mechanics will, machines will deteriorate with use 
and will need repairing from time to time. If a machine falls into to disrepair, it can be a fire hazard. Fires generally are considered uh, bad for business. Hire a janitor to maintain machines. While you're at it, we uh, make sure we've got some fire extinguishers nearby. Better safe than sorry, right? And we are ahead of the game because we already put a, a, a fire extinguisher in there. Hire a janitor. You are good at maintenance. Um, so yeah, let's, let's go, go ahead and get you. Um, can we finish with our little waiting room area yet? That, oh, that is not where I put you. That's better. I don't know if I like it right in the middle. Um, maybe right there is better. Yeah. Um, and then we can get a drinks machine. We get drinks and snacks. <gasps> no! Okay. We are moving you. Moving both of these over here. Squish you guys together. Can we fit you in? No. Um, that's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Um, maybe we'll just put the leaflet stand there. Yeah, I like it. Awesome. We've got a nice little hospital going for ourselves. Yes. So I'm thinking we'll build some rooms like here. Uh, maybe put like two or three rooms in and do another like here um, and then we're gonna have some interesting it's gonna be some interesting hospital hey uh, we got new stuff we can look at our doctors have diagnosed a new it or discovered a new illness clamp uh, once the scripts patient it doesn't let go affects afflicts many living statues and a selfie tactic Taking chumps. We'll send the patients to treatment in our pharmacy. Awesome. Um, hospital in, in reputation increase with each patient. Um, I think I already read that. I'm so excited for this game. Um, let me know if you guys want to see more. Uh, like for more because I'm excited. Oh, we have to place another fire extinguisher. Um, but where? Let's just get one out in like the reception area because I noticed those have like machines and stuff. Um, let's just put it like right there. I didn't read that. What did it say? Um, we've cured five t patients total. Um, ah, so many reading things. Um, each cure boosts our reputation, which will attract more guests, or more patients. Yes, they're patients, not guests. Got it. Um, keeping people happy. It is important to keep your staff and patients happy to ensure the hospital runs smoothly. Patients will get bored, thirsty, and hungry over time. Make sure they have access to entertainment, food, and drink, and a comfy seat when they're um, in between appointments. If they become unhappy, they will leave to go to another hospital, and we don't want that. Um, we already got all of that because I'm ahead of the game. Um, and yeah, we already know that. Item controls. Um, we already know all of that. Cool, 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 cool. Yeah, 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 yeah. Staff energy and break. Staff get tired as they work and will eventually need a break. Um, a staff room will help them relax and return to work energized. Drinks and snacks help them keep them happy too. If you need to make a room larger and fill it with interesting items, it will be considered more prestigious. Uh, people using the higher prestige room will become happier. A nice staff room will also help staff regain energy faster. So I'm assuming now we need to do a staff room. Room, staff room. Let's put a staff room right over here. Um, 
that's in line, right? Um, I can't remember. I think that's four. Is it three? Um, okay. So this would be one, two, three, four. Okay. So yeah, let's just do a four by four. A nice big staff room so we can add more stuff in. Let's do um, sitting right here. We'll do a couple armchairs. Um, let's do a locker. Um, some drinks and some snacks. Let's get garbage. Just realized we don't have any garbages out here. Let's uh, plop a couple down. I heard a noise and the cat also heard that noise. Um, can you only have- oh, okay. Just in case we got some um, clicks going on, we'll add another couch. Like, maybe this is a cool kid's couch, right? Uh, yes, please. Avoid death when possible. Staff room. Staff will head to the staff room on their break. They will fill up with interesting items to help them become fully refurbished before their break ends. You can place a member of staff in a staff room to make them take a break or work in a, or in a work room to make them work there to pick up a member of staff. Hover over them and hold the left mouse button. Awesome. Um, so is that what we're supposed to do? Um, okay, Charlie work. Drink. Drinks and snacks are great for keeping people happy, but they can lead to littering if there are no bins nearby. Well, we're at it. Uh, staff and patients will get pretty grumpy if they don't have access to any toilets. You might want to invest in some quality porcelain. Janitors will maintain all of these restocking vending machines, sweeping up litter, emptying bins, and unlocking, unblocking toilet. Not unlocking them because we just did unlock the toilets. Um, let's build some toilets. Um, I feel like this room is going to be quite large. We don't really need that there. We can do... God, toilets don't need to be that big. We'll just go like that. It's a little bigger than I uh, normally do, but that's okay. Let's get four toilets in there, I guess. I'll uh, get some sinks. I think two sinks is plenty. Um, hand dryer. Get another garbage bin in there. Do we need a fire extinguisher in here? Maybe. We'll just go like that. Yeah, um, I got the golden stuff. Uh, we don't have any kudash though. Um, pay attention to announcements. Thank you. What about the doctor's GP office? I'm listening. Cool. That's a nice big open toilet room. Janitors will empty bins. Yes, we just read that. Thank you, though. Thank you so much. Uh, further diagnosis. We are hearing reports of some new il illnesses in town. They might be harder to diagnose. We may need to build a new diagnosis room for this. If a GP isn't certain, they will send a patient for further diagnosis. General diagnosis. Okay, let's um, build that. And I know, oh, uh, okay, let's read the level and then I'll say what I was going to say if I can remember. Um, as you can, ex as you expand the hospital with more rooms and staff, the hospital level increases. A larger hospital attracts more patients. Um, as the hospital gets busier, 
queues may start to get long, so we need to build more GP GP's offices and other rooms and hire more staff to deal with the extra patients. Look out for queue warnings above rooms. You can also hover over a room to highlight to see the people that are queuing for the room. Great to know. Thank you very much. Um, anyway, as I was going to say, I know it's like good to keep all of the same type of um, rooms together. So like all of the diagnostics rooms will be together. Um, all the treatment rooms will be together um, just for less walking around and more efficiency. Um, but I feel like at this point it's okay because we don't have everything unlocked yet. Um, and so this is just kind of like the opening hospital. Not much can go wrong in it, so at least that's my understanding. Um, I could be very wrong about that. You just announced that. I am paying attention to your announcements. We'll do a nice little plant. Um, fire extinguisher. That's all we got now. Um, I think that's good enough. Well done, the hospital level has increased. Keep expanding to attract more patients and staff. Um, okay, there you are. We got a lot of people waiting at reception. Um, why'd you have to go on break? <gasps> the ward is unlocked. Okay, let's uh, just get that room, even though we technically don't need it yet. We will in a second. Hey, there it is. There's a particular new illness in town, lightheadedness. We're going to need some expensive new equipment to deal with this. Um, continue expanding the hospital to unlock the treatment room. We also may need another GP's office um, for and some more staff to keep on top of things. Okay. Um, but we're going to build the ward first. And I know we like the ward to be quite large um, for reasons. Is this a good way to put... I don't know where, where they queue. Please lower, your Please lower your expectations. We'll do some changing. Oh wow, that takes up a lot of room. Let's uh, rotate that. Okay, we can get some beds. I don't know how close together I want them. Oh, we, we can do that. I like that. It's um interesting. Interesting enough. Uh, let's get some lockers in. Um, maybe a filing cabinet. Uh, I don't like that way over there. Maybe we can move these over here. Put the filing cabinet here. Um, I don't think we need a garbage bag, bin, or extinguisher in there. Um, plant can go in the corner. Awesome. And that's a good prestige. Uh, words can be used for diagnostics to treat a range of illnesses. A nurse is required to admit each patient. I'll look after them and discharge discharge them when they are ready to leave. Add multiple beds to a ward to deal with more than one patient at a time. You can also adjust the number of nurses that should work in the room settings. Um, this is useful if you have a lot of patients. Cool. Good to know. Good to know. Um, I'm going to sip on my coffee because my voice is being weird. much better. Well, my um, voice is still being weird. New illness discovered. Um, it's called bed face. Our doctors have uh, discovered a new illness, bed face. A quite alarming contrusion of the face caused by sleeping in a strange angle. Uh, doctors recommend always using a bed protractor to monitor your sleeping angles. We'll send the patient to the ward. Sounds lovely. 
Um, what do we need to do? We need to hire a doctor. You are um, amazing. We'll just get you. We have to build another GP's office. Um, we need to hire another nurse. Um, we got pharmacy. Oh, here you go. We got ward. Awesome. Oh, we need another one too. Because that is a nurse. We need another nurse. There we go. What was that? Um, hospital level has increased. We keep expanding to keep more patients and staff. Awesome. Okay, let's build another GP's office uh, room. That's general diagnostics. No. What am I doing? GP's. Obviously. Actually, can we copy that room? Um. How do I exit this? Can I can copy it okay and then we'll just do a little bit of wait there we go there we go do a little bit of editing there um, so it's basically the same keep them all very similar uh, we have to earn now 15 thousand dollars what are you guys waiting for appointment in the gp's office habulate hospital reputation is now good oh oh wow so many things um two point hosp two point health ministry is Keen to recognize the achievements of every hospital in the county. If we can build a hospital that satisfies the needs of the local area, the hospital will be awarded an official rating, a star rating. Uh, this will be great for our organization. Not only does each star come with associated reviews, but it will also allow us to establish new hospitals around the county. Yeah, county. Uh, continue to expand the hospital and require a one-star rating. I always uh, mess up county and country. They're so close together. Uh, by completing an objective and challenges, organizations can earn kudosh. Uh, you can use that to unlock items to use at any of our hospitals. Check out to see what we can afford. Okay. Let's do the kudosh first. Um, by completing objectives and challenges and our organization earns kudosh, uh, we can use this to gain access to new items, take a look at the new items list, and use it wisely. Um, cool, that's all we're going to read of that. We got a new illness, um, bogwarts, a rather disgusting skin condition caused by filthy toilets. It can be cured with this in a expensive cocktail of drugs carefully pre 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 prepared in the pharmacy or with witchcraft we'll send the patient to the treatment for our pharmacy and another new in illness mystery guts um, chronic grumpiness due to um, something semicolon um, and again well, they're going to the pharmacy Cool, I like it. Um, we've got two patients in the ward. Three, actually. Looks like you are cured, which is great. Um, we don't have the lightheadedness, though. Um, do we? Oh, we, we do. We can build it. We can build this deluxe clinic. Let's uh, do it a little bit bigger. A little bit bigger never killed nobody. 
Um, actually, now that I'm thinking about it, I don't like how big it is. Uh, so let's hit that minus button. Yeah, because it can be that big. So we're we get, we'll just do it that much bigger. <laughs> stay away from the light. You got it. Um, put that there. Plants need water. Who would have thunk? Let's do it like that. Um, I'm gonna bin. Nah. We definitely need one of these. <gasps> no. Oh, there we go. It'll fit there perfectly. Um, do a plant. Um. Yeah. Oh, well, the prestige is so low. Oh, well, we'll come back once we have more items. I like how that just booted them out. Um, what kind of doctor? Oh, it is a doctor. Awesome. Let's hire another doctor. Holy buckets. You are amazing. We will get you for sure. Um, you... Oh, you're... You're a nurse, so we need a doctor with all of that. Um, well, if we're... We gotta pick, we're going with you, Tabitha. Um, now throw you there. We've cured 20 patients. Each cure boosts our reputation and will attract even more patients to the hospital. Yay! We are doing great things here at, um, what's our hospital name? We actually didn't name our hospital. <gasps> Staff promotion! Um, who are you? Aldo is ready for a promotion from student nurse to a junior nurse. Okay. Um, oh, where are you gonna be happy? Awesome. We want to keep our staff happy. Um, let's get some more benches around the place. Maybe there. That's a wide hallway. Oh well. Um, how do I turn items? Um, um just a couple more benches. Get a drinks and a snacks. Um, we can also get a bin and a leaflet stand. And we can do the same over here. Awesome. Look at how our hospital is coming, guys. Um, next episode, we will finish up this one star thing up in the corner here, um, expand the hospital, and just keep growing. I am so excited for the series, guys. Like down in the um, thing down below to let me know that you also are excited um, because I want to keep playing this, but I only want to play games that you want to play or want to see. So, um, please go in the comments, comment um, about the game, comment. Um, I don't know. Go like, subscribe, I guess. And yeah, we will see you guys in the next episode. Um, he's talking over me. He's being rude. Um, is he done talking yet? How do I stop him from talking? Okay. 
yeah, um, I'm gonna end the episode. I forgot what I was gonna say, but I was gonna say something. Um, oh yeah, go comment a name for this hospital because we we need to name it. That's that's all I gotta say is we need a name or a name for our county or something. Um, yeah, thanks for watching. We'll see you guys next time. Bye.